on the tandoor today, we're going to be cooking a spring leg of lamb. The benefit of doing on a tandoor is that the tandoor provides it with direct surround heat as opposed to an oven where the heat is constant and doesn't fluctuate. So a quick tip before you put the marinade on is always to slightly warm up the lamb or the meat so that the meat expands and that the marinade can penetrate into the meat. To do that, the first thing to use is a blowtorch. Gently just For the marinade, we're going to be using, again, very simple spices to preserve the taste of the meat. Spring lamb always has a very milky taste, which you want to preserve as much as you can. So we've got garlic, ginger, ground pepper, Himalayan salt, and lemon juice. So, some garlic cloves. Always remember to put more garlic than ginger. And hold some garlic cloves back because we're going to be putting some hold into the lamb. some water now it's done just pour it into here So now to prepare the lamb for the marinade. Two ways of doing it. One is we can either stab it with a fork and make holes so the marinade drops in, or we can cut slices to make steaks out of it. Slight cuts. And short stabs I'll give it a generous coating with the marinade And lastly, take a knife with a very sharp, narrow tip. Make some deep incisions. And we're going to put a whole clove right inside. That's it, job done. I recommend you leave it for at least three hours to marinate. And then, in the meantime, get it to the going.
So I've just fired up the door up. As you can see, it's nice and white inside. Once all the flames go out, we're ready to drop the lamb in. At the moment, this is around between three to 400 degrees. Once the flames die down, that heat's normally maintained as long as the walls stay white. And while I'm waiting, it's gonna down a nice cold glass of lemonade. been about three hours and now we're ready to go on balanced So it's been just under an hour. Let's open her up. And see what it looks like. I think it's gonna need another 15 minutes. So while we're doing that. Reason. An hour later, let's see what we got. Still dripping with juices. Mm. Look at that. Crisp on the outside, tender and juicy on the inside. It's all peeling off. Mm. Oh wow. Perfect. Like I was saying, because of the tandoor, excuse me, because of the tandoor, it's had surround heat, which has enabled it to cook nice and slowly and evenly.
Oh. This is amazing. You will never get this out of the oven. Thank you for all the comments and encouraging words on YouTube. Um, again, I'd like to end with a saying of the Prophet, peace be upon him, which is, he is not a believer who eats his fill whilst his neighbors beside him go hungry. During this pandemic, um, I would ask you all, I would urge you all to look out for your vulnerable neighbors, support local charities, and ultimately stay home and stay safe.